Well, Ruben, it was a, obviously a tough test against a, against a Swansea team in the Championship. What was your overall kind of thoughts on today's game? Well, uh, we're in a situation where we need uh, where we need to play competitive games. We are not in a situation that we are ready for the season because all the situation around us. And uh, we we have our, all of our players, our technical staff is working hard. I think we show where we want to be for the first 30 to 35 minutes. Then uh, we have players like Andy Carroll or uh, Jedom that it was the first uh, time that they appear in the preseason, and uh, they start to be tired. Uh, we end up with the first half well with the one nil down, but with some situations to score goals. And then the second half it was too quick. We should never be able. Doesn't matter who's playing, should be able to concede uh, three goals in five minutes, and then the game was over in that moment. Uh, so we need to learn from those mistakes and then we need to be able to compete next time. That's it. Because, I mean, as you said, in the first half in particular, controlling a lot of the play and just showing some really good stuff. And, but I guess that's the, the situation, as you said, some of those guys are still working their way in, you know, even to end the pre-season. So, as you said, maybe not quite ready yet for the start of the season in some ways. Yeah, and we should not forget that we are playing against teams that are above our level. And uh, it's the last match for them and their preparation and they are far away. Far, far, far better prepared than us in terms of uh, the squad and the players that are going to start the season for them. So it's, it's a good test. I think we still have some good beats. We don't like to lose, uh, and that's that's the most uh, heartbreaking thing. But uh, yeah, we will take it what it is. Some things we cannot control, and we will keep working hard and trying to show our identity. That's it. So it was important, I guess, to get players like Andy Yedon. Andy Carroll and Amadou all on the pitch for the, for the first time in pre-season. Charlie Savage as well. I mean, it's, again, we're a little bit later than we'd like to be, but these are important steps, aren't they, for us? Absolutely, absolutely, and that's why when we when we are able to use those players with the experience that they have or with the potential that they have, we need to use them. Uh, unfortunately, another ones like Louis Wing, uh, we need to wait a little bit more to to see him, but. Uh, this we need to use this. We need to remember that it's a precision, and the precision is just ready to prepare things. And then uh, the real, the real competition starts on next the next Saturday. Mm, exactly seven days' time back here against Peterborough. As you said, that's the the real competition. We'd like to see as many fans in as possible supporting the team. I guess that's your message to the fans, right? To kind of get behind whatever team we start on Saturday, just start the new chapter for us. Yeah, I think uh, I think nobody is uh, bigger than Reading, and uh, it doesn't matter if it's technical staff, players, or etc. And I think the fans should be behind their team. We know it's a difficult time, and hopefully we will go over those, those this difficult time together. So we need their support. And without their support, for sure, we cannot do it. So we expect them to be with the team that they have been in the last weeks.